What you cooking this morning? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you gonna cook us some chicken this morning? It will be. So what you trying to do? Some chicken and waffles. Some of our furniture supposed to come on the twenty third for this apartment here. Guys, as y'all know, this is, I told you before, this is my other apartment. I have not furnished it yet. We are waiting on some of the furniture to ship and come. So we're just doing what we got to do because I love to be in this area. Um, and I will probably, you know, I'm trying to think if I'm going to do the celebration of our 10K celebration in this apartment or in my other house. But anyway, um, that's not what this video is about. But I was just showing you guys, like, to remind you the reason why my apartment is empty because this is my second house and I haven't furnished it yet. I'm waiting on some of the furniture to arrive. But this video is Jalen. My higher functioning artistic Jalen. <laughs> he he is cutting up some chicken. That's all you gotta cut up. I want a few more. Can cut up a few more because he. Cutting up some chicken, guys, because he's about to fry some chicken. Because we love chicken, 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 chicken. <laughs> yeah. I don't really watch him too, too much because he pretty much knows what to do. Um, And he knows how to handle the knife and stuff. So, But I just came on because... Jalen is about to cook us some breakfast this morning. And that's another thing with some people. They be like, how can you eat lunch and dinner food at breakfast time? Who said that you can't eat dinner food at breakfast time, honey? Who said that it just had to be bacon, eggs, cheese, sausage, croissants, or, you know, bagels? Just because... Some people like to eat breakfast food. Oh, well, you know, I eat dinner food at breakfast time, honey. That's the way I grew up. I'm a Gen X. Honey, my, if you go in grandma and they'll go in there and cook you some rice and pork chop or you warm up some leftover rice and pork chop or something that you had the night before, that's your breakfast, what baby. Huh? Do I want some more? I don't want to be greedy. I think this is going to be okay. I think this is going to be okay. So what you about to do with it now? Say the rest? Huh? Okay. Are you going to get started now? Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And okay. like this. Okay, good. You rewashing your hands? That is great, Jalen. That is great. 
And please, this time, don't put a bunch of too much. Don't get too heavy with the the them couple. Um, why don't you do it in that one in your in your container that you put your chicken in? That way it won't be um, easier to have too much salt on it. Yeah, why don't you do it in your seasoning? Yeah, pour all your chicken in there. There you go. That'll be easier. Where That way it'd be less error to have too much seasoning on, on it. Good. They're definitely washing your hands after touching and messing with this chicken. Definitely helps cut cross contamination. Very good. Very good. Yeah, be easy on the lemon pepper, please, because you know you got a heavy hand. <laughs> Okay, guys, the seasonings that I, I keep a basket, two, three baskets full of seasonings. Okay, tell the people what you're using, the seasonings. First thing first, I use lemon pepper. Lemon pepper. And I use paprika. Paprika. And garlic powder. And, garlic powder. and that's all we need. I normally have onion powder in all of those. I don't even know if I have some of those in there. No, no, no. I don't have no onion powder. And then I normally use just garlic and pepper, but I ran out of those guys. So, mm -hmm. and now he can shake up his chicken in the breader. I told Jalen that's a. I bought this container for him to make it easier for him to mix up and shake his chicken to bread it. And coat it. Yeah. There you go. And now, okay. Freshly coated on both sides. Uh-huh. Yep. So now it's coated. Okay, and so what do we have here? So oil. You think this is enough oil? We should. Okay. Well, maybe, like I said, just don't fry it too fast. And I'm trying to... um. Okay, you don't want to get your grease to get too hot. You better check it. You don't want it to start getting too hot. But you'll be able to put more in it. They should be about ready for you. Because you know this burner here will get hot quick. I'm 
girl. Okay, I'm gonna just look and see. Mm. You can try to put one more back on the back side. It ain't gonna hurt. Back here on this back side. Um, over that side or the back side right there. Mm -hmm. And let's see, that's good. All right, that's good enough, I guess. I could have squeezed. Okay, so as you know, Jalen's chicken is going to be good and crispy. Well, all right, guys. Um, I just snapped some pictures eventually uh, when Jalen is done. <laughs>